Hello, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages. I am the Tri-State Big Mouth. Now, if you don't know me, most of you don't. I am a comedian. I am a great debater. I've debated a lot of people from all sorts of religions. Uh, most of the times, my videos get flagged on Facebook. At this moment, I want to direct you to the truth about Sam Shamoon. You see, as you guys think, he's a lovable, caring Christian. He's always hanging out with David Wood, who's a good person in real life, by the way, that David Wood. But I can't say the same about Sam Shamoon. I used to think so myself. You see, I am a JW student. The reason I can't be baptized is, well, I still do things that are against JW standards. But, however, I have enough knowledge to rock the socks of any Sam Shamoon of any world. You see, the devious snake, the son of Judas, the person who sits there talking about defending Judas, talking about he might have a resurrection one day, is the exact person that you want to blame. You see, I never listened to anything uh, coming from uh, anybody that I debated's mouth, but they told me that he has tons of child support, and judging by his characteristics, the man made fun of my dead mother, the man couldn't handle me in a two-minute debate. He hung up on me like a scolded dog. He ran with his tail tucked between his legs. You see, once you give a man like Sam Shamoon, who's trying to testify Trinity to you, trying to give you Bible standards, when he, in fact, has no clue what a Bible is, because the hypocrite, again, the son of Judas, can't reply properly. He goes, you want to be so stupid? He hung up on me because I was about to berate him with Bible knowledge. I was about to show him that his God, Jesus, bowed to my God. Yet he turned the Trinity into not Jesus being God, now the Father, who is Jesus. So he knew what was coming up. I was going to have him prove it from the Bible. But when he saw me put him in the corner and spank him royally, he hung up on me. He refuses to debate me. I've tried numerous of times on Twitter, on Instagram, on Facebook, on YouTube. He refuses to debate me. Why? Because I'm giving him Bible knowledge. And like the true prejudiced two-faced snake that he is, he runs like a scolded dog. Now I'm going to post this video and I'm going to challenge you openly, Sam Shamoon, to a debate where you can't run away to a debate where you have to be a man, to a debate where I will get you to admit that you are a cowardly snake waiting for people's donations. You see, unlike Jehovah's Witnesses, people like Sam Shamoon are snakes and need your donations. Jehovah's Witnesses work for a living. They don't ask anybody for donations. This is the type of snakes that you guys represent. This is the type of snakes that you guys accept to be your heads of Christianity. This is not Christianity, this is hypocrisy. And this is my job. So, if you have any questions about JW, have fun, feel free to ask, I will come back to you. Whatever you would like. Other than this, Sam Shamoon, one more time, if you want to debate without you running like a scolded dog, I'm open to debate. If you want to pay your child support since you're taking donations anyway, you might want to be man enough to take care of your own seed. You hypocrite two-faced snake. What a low-life scumbag move, by the way. I am the Tri-State Big Mount, and there's a reason they call me that. Now, have a great day. And remember, if you don't like JW, well, Jesus said it from his own words. They will hate you as they have hated me. Remember, the Pharisees also hated Jesus because he kept telling them the truth. Well, guess what there, hypocrites? When you guys want to put in the fact that Christianity is made this way with three gods that you call Jesus, I will be right there with this beautiful face to spank you with reality. Jehovah is your God, Jesus is your King, and there's nothing you could do about it. Psalms 83, 18 sums that up properly. John 3, 16 is as specific as it gets. God sent his son. It doesn't say God sent himself in representation of his son. 
The sons of God in Genesis are the angels. So Jesus was an angel sent to earth. Have a good day, and if you don't like it, I could care less. If you have any questions, hit me up.